great group of young ladies. They're all very talented, and any one of them could walk away with the crown tonight and represent Appanese County very well. So again, thank you, and uh, enjoy your evening. Okay, thank you very much, Jared. And I do believe that Rachel maybe would like to uh, come forward and say a few words about her experience last year and uh, certainly representing our fair all year long. And she's done a great job. Good evening, everyone. Well, it's definitely been a great year to be the Athens County Fair Queen. I've definitely experienced a lot, and it's all definitely been good. Well, I'll try to keep it short because I know I have six very nervous girls behind me. And they're all going to do great. They're, they're all six wonderful candidates. I had the experience to go to two, the Iowa State Fair, which is just a great experience in itself. But as I was talking to every girl there, you know, no one has a support system like we do here. Jara, Geraldine, and Judy do an amazing job doing this. And I'm truly lucky to be from Athens County. Also, I'd like to thank my mom, because without her, I would have never made it to any of these events, or been ready, or been sane. So I definitely owe her that. And um, I just want to tell all these good girls that good luck and you'll do great. Thank you, our reigning queen. Well, next I would like to uh, thank our kind businesses and individuals who have helped to make this contest possible. Photography by the Browns for the large portrait on display at the exhibit building. We're giving a five by seven portrait on display at the exhibit building and for giving a five by seven group photo to each contestant and for giving the queen an 11 by 14 portrait of herself. Judy Lawson, Jarrah Cassidy and Geraldine Inman for donating the queen's trophy. Curtis and Donna Siebel for the first runner up trophy and Raymond's Dairy Cream for the second runner up trophy. Also thanks to Iowa Trust and Savings Bank, the Fair Board, the Fair Queen Committee, Friedley Theater, Cinema 4, Owl Pharmacy, and Hardee's for giving each contestant a gift. Thanks to Skin and Stones for donating a set of earrings to the new queen. And thanks to the Daily Iowegian, the Molten Tribune, the Bravey Union, and KCOG and KMGO for their coverage. And now I would like to introduce our escorts for this evening. First of all, Cody Courthouse. And joining Cody, Roman Royer. Before I introduce the candidates, I would like you to know the judging was held last Thursday evening. The judging scores were based on the following. Beauty, personality, leadership, citizenship, and overall appearance. And now, we will introduce you to our six candidates. I'm Victoria Severson. I'm 16 years old, and I'm the daughter of Mark and Penny Howe and Bob Severson. Victoria will be a junior this fall at Moravia High School. She is involved in FFA, FCCLA, Mohawk Voices, Color Guard, Cheerleading, Chorus, Show Chorus, Silver Chord Program, Kids Against Hunger, and is a Character Counts mentor. Honors received include being named Student Body Treasure, was the district FCCLA president, 2007 youth group volleyball MVP, and received a level two rating at the 2009 Iowa High School Musical Association solo contest. Tori's hobbies are working on the farm, spending time with friends and family, watching movies, and shopping. Tori plans on attending Indian Hills in Ottumwa. She would like to become a physical therapist and major in rehabilitative therapy. Ladies and gentlemen, Tori Severson. Woo! 